<laughs> Eating on duty. <laughs> Hello everyone. Hope you are having a good day. Good. I don't know what time you'll be seeing this video, but good morning, afternoon, evening. Um welcome back. I'm Nade Donya Abraham. I'm just starting this video now because I'm on my way to the dentist. I'm taking my baby for our first dental appointment just to look at her teeth, make sure that we are doing the right thing. My sister and I are also going to get a this whitening shine is what we are going to do. We already did scaling and polishing how many months ago now? Like four three four months ago well we are going to start our teeth whitening procedure apparently it takes a few appointments i think she said three this is our first one i forgot to take my camera but i'll use my phone to film and carry you along bye <laughs> get the hair done her name is tabitha yes that's me if you're in grimsby please holler at your girl she does really nice braids um conros she does wigs and all um she sells hair she sells hair exactly so um today what are you doing today conros yeah <laughs> That's why we now call rose. Very particular style or something. Just color color. <laughs> color color color. And to make our hair today, we have tea. Yeah, she made us tea. So if you come to make your hair, just make your request. Tea, wine, champagne, you know, whatever. So we're having tea and the uh, brioche bread with butter. Yeah. Mm. It's not one. It's the best you should have ordered. Yeah. 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 So Especially in this particular scent. Mm. I opened everything the day I chose this one. Mm. And this was my favorite of all time. It smells mm. beautiful. It's called Linen Freshes Astonish. No, 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 I'm serious. But my own thing is. But I'm recording your concern of big me. But my thing is. I don't know all those measurements. Things. So how can I write recipe? I don't know. So, you don't need to write measurements. So now. just write, put your plant in. For the sun. I <laughs> 
Say hello. Hello everyone. Are you okay? Are you okay, Raina? Hello everyone. Um at this point I feel like the last clip you would have seen would have been the clip of me going to the dentist. But I wasn't really allowed to film in there, so I didn't really show what was happening. But it's basically a teeth whitening procedure. There's nothing wrong with my teeth. Sorry, we are going to have a lot of this madam in and out of this clip because she has chosen to <laughs> terrorize me today. But yeah. I'm trying to get my teeth whitened just because I feel like I'll look nicer if my teeth are whiter. It's not like they look bad, but they can always look better. Over here, we are not baddies. So the least we can do if we can't be baddies is to look like nice, classy, clean ladies. And that's the plan. But yeah, I'm here because I want to do an unboxing. Ray, here's my other thing a quick unboxing for my tripod for my camera. Before that, I just wanted to mention shout out to my sister for buying me new scrub daddy, oh, new scrub daddy sponges. Is this come? No, this is scrub mommy actually. This is scrub mommy. Because I love them. I use them to clean my coke, coca top. So she decided to get me a pack. Because she knows these are the little things that make me happy. Cleaning products make me happy. <sighs> Ray. Cleaning products make me happy. Um, just house stuff makes me happy. So she decided to buy that for me, but this is what we are here to unbox. I behave like a bush girl again. I'm filming on my phone because I want to show when I mount the tripod on the camera. Ray, can they see what I'm unboxing? I can only see you. Okay, take that one. You want that one? Whoa, so pretty. <laughs> oh my God. Yay. Ah, so happy for mommy. No, it's not yours. Can we open? So it's basically the Sony GPVP. Something, something tripod, yeah? The tripod for my camera. Open. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Wait, Raina, wait, please. There's also this. Oh, I think it's to keep the tripod in. Maybe Is this supposed to use battery? There's a battery in it. But yeah, this is what it looks like. I'm struggling over here. Ray, do you know that? Here's my camera. Somebody, no! Oh my goodness. So, this is what it looks like. It basically has functions on it. So that when you mount the camera, you don't have to... You use the actual buttons on the camera you can just use the buttons on the tripod at least the basic functions i think and there's Daddy. something to screw it under here so that's what i'm doing right now you're just everywhere in this in this clip wow. Wow. And yeah it can be a tripod Yee. Or a selfie stick. Whoa. Whoa. So let's turn it on and connect it. Feel 
Eu, velho, que eu fico com o bate aí nesse tempo. O Willow se bate em gol. Yeah, I was right, so I was supposed to use a camera, a battery. So I've put that in now, and I'm trying to follow the manual for how I'm supposed to pair it to the camera. On the camera, select menu, Bluetooth settings, functions on. Okay. Hey. So now the camera is asking if I want to allow pairing with the device. So I just say okay. So now it's connected. G B B B D is connected. Ten thousand pounds. Oh, yes. Yeezy's shoes is two thousand pounds. Oh, thereabouts. Thereabouts. My jeans. Yeah. Is uh, one thousand five hundred. <laughs> okay. My Tommy. Hey, Tommy. Get it. Oh. Get in there. <laughs> I bought it from Canada. Yeah. Okay. It's two thousand Canadian dollars. Good. Is this diamond. Oh yes. Original diamond. <laughs> How much is that? That's fifteen thousand. Oh, yeah. about this one? Oh, don't talk about that one. Forget it. Forget. It's a gift from my husband. Well, from Paris. Whoa. Oh, what is it from Switzerland? Whoa. Yeah. From Paris, from Switzerland. You have to choose one. This is a very. How about the hair? The hair. It's from Chanel. No. I think it's from the. Best. Yeah, please, London. Yeah. London. London. Yeah. 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 Well, you're feeling your drip. Head to toe. How about your stroller? Because you're attached to the stroller. <laughs> taking my family to the train station because they are going on a weekend trip i'm the one working hard and they are the ones enjoying weekend trip but it's okay i'm happy for them anyway i this is the face of a very 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 tired young woman what would i call myself i'm not a girl i'm still a girl but ah uh, i dagba so yeah I've been working all week and I've been working till midnight and it's my last shift today but as at yesterday I was struggling <laughs> I was struggling like I love working in a and &E. my first job in the UK was an a and &E job I love working in the a and &E. but the tiredness when you become a mom I'm so glad I finally met someone when I started my a and &E job that talked about the fact that when you become a mom, like, the tiredness is different. Even when you do things that are not even as stressful as what you used to do before you became... Like, you are just very tired. Like, the way I was tired, I was like, what's happening? I said, okay, maybe because I'm hungry, I'm trying to do intermittent fasting. So I'm like, maybe when I take my break, I had started work since 1 p.m., and this was around 7, 8-ish. I'm like, maybe when I take my break and I eat... I'd already had breakfast. I had a smoothie and a sandwich. Yeah, and hash brown. And I felt okay when I take my break oh, and I come back. I'll feel better. I'll feel rejuvenated. I will feel. 
I was struggling. By 10 o'clock, I had to go to the toilet, put water on my face, mop it up, pay, I did on you. <laughs> because I can't, I, I, I wasn't sick. So I can't say, oh, I want to go home. I'm, I was just exhausted. Meanwhile, in all of this, they are trying to change our routers and trying to make us work longer hours, something like that. Like, everybody has, has fought it because it makes no sense. Doing 12-hour shifts every day how many days a week working two weekends a month like it's ridiculous and at first they like they were like oh they had a meeting all oh, the doctors agreed to it now everybody i'm now wondering who agreed to it because everyone i know is like they are so upset with maybe people didn't know what he meant until they saw the actual rotasha i don't know but i'm struggling but this is me i was supposed to work three till twelve today as well but someone called in sick for a 10 to 7 shift i'm like i'm tired but i think i'd rather just get it out of the just do the shift and get it out of the way so i've asked and I'm, they are happy for me to come in to work but because we need like is it 11 hours or 11 and a half hours in between each shift because i finished at 12 yesterday i can't go in until 11 today and this is like 10 15. so ask me why i just said i'm tired but ask me why because the problem is, I didn't know, I already got ready and started getting dressed. And then they said, no, come in at 11. So I had to take my clothes off and I'm like, I'm ready to start my day. I can't just sit and we need to, I've not cooked. I've hardly cooked in the last few weeks because my shifts have been funny and I've been coming home really late, like midnight kind of late, coming home tired. So ask me why in my tiredness I'm cooking. I have like 15 minutes till I actually need to leave home, but ask me why I'm frying beef. Yeah, I'm frying beef because I want to make jollof rice. I have like more beef stock here, leftover stew that I'm going to add rice. I have my tomato paste here. I'm using my tripod and I'm enjoying it. Sorry about it, like lightning situation i can't be bothered to start turning on lights i have a delivery do i this looks like the every man i'm really enjoying the tripod anyway like it makes everything so nice and steady ah you know come my house so don't be me get delivery oh that's heavy i wanted to do a quick unboxing at some point you have to agree that i always do unboxings i'm a shopaholic i love shopping let me get something to open. I've not checked this beef in a while. I'm here doing video. I was watching YouTube and then I decided to just start this video. But before my beef will burn, I think that's all I'll be able to do actually. Just fry the beef and start going to work. I think I will fry faster than this. But this wok I'm using to fry it is not the best of cookware. I like closing the door because I'm trying to avoid making the whole house smell of food. Because if it's by the way I cook, the whole house will be full of food and food stains and things. So just a quick unboxing from Boots. It's just basically skincare stuff. Mostly for my sister, I think. Because she was the one that chased me to help her order stuff from Boots. I always help everyone order skincare because... I'm the only one that has like boots chain and membership. What they call it? Boots share something card. Yeah, membership card. And I like to help everyone order so I can get points from their order. It's heavy. Heavy. But yeah. The first thing is this. So my sister has very sensitive skin. So we are trying to find a good balance of like a moisturizing cream for her to use. She was using the La Roche-Posay one. But La Roche-Posay is an expensive brand. That's one too. I only buy them when they are on like sale on like buy three for the price of two. 20% of Yeah, it was my delivery. Is it mine? It's not. Sorry. So... <clears throat> We tried to buy because Boots was doing buy three La Roche-Posay products for like the price of two. So I'm like, we can buy your body cream and all of that. And then it was all sold out and she needs like body cream. 
I'm like, yeah, let's look for something new to try. And I know CeraVe is a good brand. I use their... Is it CeraVe or Cetaphil? CeraVe. I use their blemish control range for like face wash and retinol. And she's using the CeraVe... CeraVe, yeah. CeraVe moisturizing cream for her face and she likes it. So I'm like, yeah, let's try this. And it was also on like buy three for the price of two. So that's why we have three of them. This is just the moisturizing cream. There's nothing else about it. It's just the moisturizing cream. And what else do we have? So yeah, this is the body scrub that I use. The Dove one. I really love Dove products. So I use their body scrub, body spray, body wash. Yeah, that's why all I use from them. And I really like this pomegranate and shea butter one. I know there's one rice one. I want to try it. I'm not a very big fan of change. I don't like change. Like if I know something and I'm used to it, it will take a lot for me to change. <laughs> for example, if something is cheaper, that's when I'll change it. So yeah, we have, we both have the Fenty lip stain, but she wanted a different color because the one she has, she says it's too dark. It's too red or too dark. So she wants to try a different one. So we got, I think the one she has is strawberry sangria and she wanted to try something lighter so we got the come on come on my type color one i hope she likes it as i said this is mostly for my sister but i did it you find out why i did this very soon this is also for her is the Ghanaian serum vitamin c niacinamide salicylic acid this is why i use as my serum as well for daytime skincare routine so i want her to try it as well see if she likes it because the vitamin c she was using finished so we're trying this and it was trust me that it was also on reduced price usually it's like 9.99 i think this time it was like 6.99 or something even this dove body scrub usually it's like she's seven pounds six pounds i don't know how it makes it i've never bought it at that price i only buy it when it's half price so i bought two for like three pound fifty no sorry each not both if i see that wolf i want to have bought just two and the reason why i bought all this stuff for her is she offered to buy me something so i've been trying to find a good night cream and what was i using i have tried a few different ones i've tried a nivea rose water one i've tried what am I using now? I think Cetaphil. But I don't really... I've not found one that I really like. And as I said, I like her. <laughs> so I always apply to do like sampling testers for brands on like Instagram or wherever. And I tried the Clarins. I think it's called the Double Serum. It smells amazing. It's so lightweight. Like the only reason why I haven't bought it is it's very expensive. Um, so <laughs> i'm like i can try different things in the clarins range at least now i'm i'm getting older whether i want to accept it or not so i need to start looking into like good affordable skincare for my skin to make sure that when we are 50 60 we are still looking popping so all this long story is i decided to try clarins night cream there were different ones by the time i did filter i saw different night creams and I was seeing funny, funny price. I just went low to high. Price low to high. Sought by low to high. Because why am I seeing 50 something, 60 something pounds for nice cream? She'll see. Just to apply, I will drink my water. Me by walking, boom, me saying soju. Anyway, so I saw this and this one was on reduced price for like, is it 34 or 36 pounds? And she still offered to buy it for me. So who am I not to place her order? Call me for your personal shop. I'm joking. I can't do it. But yeah, I decided to be a personal shopper because she decided to buy this for me. Thank you, baby girl. This one is Hydra Essential. Plumps, moisturizes, and quenches night care for all skin types. And it has hyaluronic acid. I'm a sucker for hyaluronic acid because it's so moisturizing. One of my other face cleansers is the Hydro Boost Face Wash. 
and I've been stuck on it for like three years now because when I wash my face with that cleanser and I touch my face, oh, it's beautiful. Yeah, you can see me. I'm ready to go to work now. I finished stealing all the beef I fried, but I'm running late so I need to leave now. I already packed my food for lunch. It's just basically leftovers. Yesterday I was at work. Ask me why my husband didn't think he should make food that he can take to work for lunch today. I was busy making fried plantain and seeing a lamb chops and stew. Just took liberty. I'm just made what he wanted, so there's nothing like there was nothing substantial to take for lunch. But there was one leftover spaghetti in the fridge and then I just had some of his plantain and lamb chops. I don't know if it will be enough but it's good for diets. Because, yeah. So I'm going to be taking some juice as well. I always drink cold stuff no matter what the weather is. Finishing my, I wanted to try this drink. I saw it as that strawberry and kiwi. It's not bad, and it doesn't have so many calories. But I don't think I'll be buying again because it has a funny aftertaste. I know my sister will watch this video and say, "She be I told you, and you say it's a lie." I'm sorry, but that's it's not going to fill my cup. So I'm going to introduce you to the next. Best thing after jollof rice. If you're Nigerian and you like pure, pure heaven red grape wine, you need to stop buying it. Don't waste your money. Just go to Asda and buy red grape juice. It tastes exactly the same. Except for the fizziness, everything else is exactly the same. I mean, this is even better because even the, I don't know if you know the, what's it called now? Is it aftertaste I'll call it when you drink, I say red grape, pure heaven. Maybe it's a grape thing that you just make your mouth. Oh man, even this juice has it. I love it so much. I tried it once and I'm like, yes. No more pure heaven for me, except you are very bent on the fizziness. Then go and buy soda water and add it and still buy this one. It's cheaper. So I'm just going to be adding that to it. Yes, I have a full cup of juice. I was going to do a scent of the day but as I said I was literally ready like I was ready to leave the room I was about to unplug my phone to go to work when I saw the message about coming in later at 11 so I already used my perfume <sighs> why, why are you chasing me? let me see I do you hello everyone please ignore my cameraman I don't know what I've done to deserve this hi guys to your favorite, to have your favorite YouTuber. How do you know I'm their favorite one? Don't go also for money, she's tired <laughs> as fuck. <well. laughs> Which also I also know be my normal work, I go do. See that. To work for money is not easy. At all, honestly. Anybody okay. that has free money. <laughs> she's, she's still maintaining beauty though. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>